It's number three on Sierra Week. Joe, I have been loving these dance moves, and this song is called One Two Step. I'm loving these dance moves too. The I title, just, the title is about dancing. It's great. That's the whole point of the video. One you, two step. Is, is, I, you know, it's something. If you have an artist that can dance, you don't even have to think too much about music videos at that point. I believe I mean, people yeah, say maybe throwing a little bit of love interest or something like that, but like. Dancing goes a long way. Dancing goes a long way. And we got to thank Carrie L. Thank you, Carrie L. Uh, Joe, I believe people call it a full send. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah. When you got an artist that can dance, full send dance. Just dance it up. Just get some good dance choreo. Dance it up. Send it. A good beat, some good choreo, some catchy, some catchy melodies, and just start dancing. That's right. This was featuring one of our faves, Missy Elliott, who we got to do a week of. Yeah. She does, she does not disappoint. The moves are, even the simple one-two step, it's still just so much fun. Man, I didn't know that's what a one-two step was. Well, it seems she's done a few different one-two steps in this video. Yeah, yeah the one-two step is just like, uh, it's like the the choreographer, how they like count you out. They're like, one-two step. Yeah. You know, or like five, six, seven, eight. You know, that's, that's like the classic count in from a choreographer. And, <laughs> and here and we go. And we're and at the I'm show. <laughs> and I'm over here. Dancing to the music, man. Joe, this whole intro was incredible. You got the hype guy. You got Ladies Missy. and gentlemen, gentlemen, gentlemen. And then it just drops right in the first verse. Wait, I mean, they say ja- is it Jazzy? Jazzy made it. Jazzy. Was it just Jazzy or Jazzy something? Jazzy made productions. I think that's said? Missy Elliott, right? Uh, I, don't I think. Know. I just got, let's listen to this intro real quick. It's so good. Ladies and gentlemen, and gentlemen, gentlemen, gentlemen. This is a jazzy fizzle. Fizzle. Produc- fizzle. Produce. Just in. Man, what? that beat I mean, is automatic, supersonic, hypnotic, yeah. funky, fresh. Funky, fresh. It's got to be. And that is just the greatest lineup of adjectives I've ever heard in my <laughs> life. It's it is. just, it's just all the things. Um, I don't know how to. I don't know. I don't know exactly how to how to describe any of those. A lot of those, but right. I, and me neither. Well, I, I know fresh. Oh, uh, fresh is like a well, stick funky, of- fresh. Funky Fresh is confusing. That's like you have garlic breath, but you just brush your teeth. <laughs> That's like you have garlic breath, but you're really hungry, so it's okay. That's <laughs> Funky Fresh. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we could keep going. I could go on with that. <laughs> the wheels are spinning. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, this is a mid-pause. Yeah. Um, okay. The, the only thing I wanted to comment on is it's a classic, uh, a classic thing to do in the intro of a rap or hip-hop song to like... Shout out the names as the beat's building up and then you yeah. drop in. But this one, it's like extra epic or something. Like it doesn't stop. It just keeps going and going and going. And all of a sudden you're just in the song. Like yeah. a lot of other, okay, so for example, DJ Khaled, like DJ Khaled. And then it was like a couple of seconds of silence. He's like, we the best music. And then yeah. it's like, 
you know, and it's like, this one was so beautifully orchestrated. I was just very impressed. It was it whoever was this gentleman is. Please I let me know in the comments. Is, I, I don't. Is know who he, he is. jazzy? No, he's not. I, oh, maybe he is. I always thought it was Missy Elliott. <laughs> Why can't we get a feature on this? It says featuring Missy Elliott, but it doesn't say uh, Mr. Jazzy. Maybe you're right. Maybe he is jazzy. But I always thought jazzy was Missy Elliott's production because oh. she's a producer as well. I love his voice too. Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, gentlemen. And gentlemen. And I love that she's going around her neighborhood teaching some dance moves to all the kids. Ah, it's just good old fashioned fun. Yeah, that's yeah. that's classic. And I'm really liking. Uh, sorry, last comment. I'm loving her hair in this one. This is a different look than the other videos. Ah, yes, it's very nice. Does she always have this lighter, almost like amber colored hair? I think in the other ones she didn't. Right? I don't know. I can't okay. remember. That's all right. All right, let's keep it rolling. Say hello, cause they know I'm rocking the beat. I know you heard about a lot of great MCs, but they ain't got nothing on me. Because I'm five for two, I wanna dance with you, and I'm sophisticated fun. I eat filling me on, and I'm nice and young. Best believe I'm number one. body spray scene it's just with this song it's just the it's just a clash of worlds all at the same time i mean axe was everywhere i remember those commercials they were all over the place it was like all my friends wore it yeah it was the thing well see especially back then so like this guy's just loading himself up with it. Yeah, oh man. There he is. You can't just do one spray. <laughs> <laughs> but at this time, I remember what? I was probably 13 or something like that. And uh I'd have my and, and this is this is when the song's coming out so we would all be going what this is another classic school dance song. Oh, dude, when um when that bridge hit the, with mm-hmm. the with those special synthesizers and everything mm-hmm. that brought brought back so many memories. It was like, oh, I rem- I just like that because that was my favorite part back then. And, and then it clicked. I was like, oh, I have so many memories. And then I knew every word to Missy Elliott's rap verse. Oh, you did. I was like, I've heard this song a million times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I back. So this is another classic dance yeah, yeah. school dance. Uh, and uh, yeah, just. One two step. I don't, but I wish I knew the one two step. I wish I'd watch the video. I didn't have MTV, so I didn't get to watch any of these videos yeah. as a young boy. I also didn't have MTV. Oh, you didn't. In case you were wondering, I was asking. Uh, and then I'm dancing, and I'm, I'm, you know, I'm just trying to like grind up with my other twelve year old, twelve year old. I'm twelve years old, just <laughs> dancing around. This is how grinding works. And then the nuns are like, get away from each other, you know. Yeah. And uh, that's going on. But the act stuff is important because we would go into the boys' locker room after PE. And uh, oh, it's so just, I Joe. mean, it was like smoky in there. You couldn't see. There's That's so much funky fresh. <laughs> that is funky fresh. That ain't fresh. Sweaty, sweaty teens. Blast, blasting <laughs> themselves with 
with, with, with different a, flavors, different varieties of Axe body spray. So it's just like this glo- amalgamation of grossness. Global warming took a step back every time <laughs> every time gym class got out because the young boys were just filling the entire room. We literally just hose each other down with Axe body spray. But our mom was pretty cheap, so I didn't have any. So I had to just like walk through everyone else's clouds, you know. You just catch some on the way yeah, back. Yeah, I had to catch a, catch a few puffs, you know. And then I, I could go out and be like, oh, you smell like seven different accents. It's like, yeah, so does everyone. Yeah, because I have them all. <laughs> because I have, yeah, I, I own them all. I spritz a little bit of each one on. That's how I roll. It's very confusing. I have like <laughs> Phoenix and I think there was one called Chocolate. Nice. And uh, I don't know, Ghost. Yeah, yeah. These are bizarre names. Energy. Yeah, yeah. Well, Joe, it was that was the, that was the era. Joe, you're like uh, trying to show off. I'm a luxurious man. Yeah, I have yeah. all seven cents. Yeah, my mom bought a two ninety nine dollar can of Axe, <laughs> and uh, now I'm a luxurious man because I put half of it on today after pee, <laughs> and it's hard to breathe around me. <laughs> Dude, it was it's man. Terrible. Oh, and Axe also had the uh, the body wash with all the beads in it. Oh yeah, but then people really started being upset with the beads because they weren't biodegradable yeah, they were getting, going into the sewer systems getting stuck in fish and stuff uh anyways so i love all the dancing of course and i love missy elliott she's got a little gum in her mouth oh nice she's just chewing it she's casual Man. and joe of course this is the obligatory hoop earring moment hoop earring moment for me that's my favorite thing if no, if nobody's caught on yet i want to say there might have been hoop earring restrictions in our catholic school like you couldn't have them too big yeah like no bigger than a quarter or something like that <laughs> really i think so i don't recall definitely couldn't chew gum you could not chew gum uh i like whatever like bare bones speaker room this is that they're in if it, it probably yeah. is loud in there oh i did want to point out sierra is wearing also one of my favorites sierra oh crud sorry guys we're here to call each other out every time we screw up yeah yeah but um okay here you can see it this connection i believe it's like a necklace connected to the hipless oh the hipless which we've we've coined the term from yeah. What and week anyone, was that? Oh, Aaliyah week. It was Aaliyah, Aaliyah week. and I believed uh, we were like, what What do you call this? It's yeah. not a belt. And everyone told us uh, belly chains, but I'm just gonna say you're wrong. I'm gonna go with hipless. I, yeah, that feels hipless, right. hipless sounds. It's way harder to say, um, <laughs> and it's really off putting. Kind of it makes it seem like they don't have any hips. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but it sounds like hipless as opposed to like hip a lace. A nick lace yeah. for your hips, a hip lace. Uh, uh, hip, uh, uh, nah. And look at Sierra's smile here. That's I great. love to see a pop star smiling is just a beautiful thing because, you know, a lot of them are sad deep down inside. Yeah, I don't know if she's sad deep down inside. I don't know Sierra that well. S- Sierra, yes. Yeah. That's you, right. were wait- you were trying to call uh, me out on that. Man, it just like... I mean, when you spend 20 years saying someone's name incorrectly. Yeah, it's hard to let go. But I, I'm I'm really putting an effort in here. I think people can agree I've been doing a pretty decent job. Yeah. Yeah, we're just trying and to so keep each other Joe. accountable. Hold each other accountable, <laughs> yeah. I like her little, like, one-two-step kind of running. <laughs> one-two-step. Running man here, whatever it is. Yeah, it's it's really great. And then yeah, like you said, getting getting the whole community. and the roller skates. Yes, that I that's what I was looking for. Okay, thank you for reminding. Yeah, me. you know what, dude, I love they're about going this? like forty on those things. They were cruising. Well, hold yeah. on, I want to talk about uh, these kids are probably our age. Oh, yeah, you know, yeah, that's like crazy. we we they're could, like they're, yeah they're like in their thirties now. Yeah, these are adults. They could be watching the show. <laughs> hey, that's me. <laughs> Comment if it's you. Yeah, uh, or someone you know. Uh, all right, so the roller bl- the roller skaters. No, oh, those guys are going like thirty. And I'd be I so scared you, of a rock. Roller skates weren't trendy yet. No, you know, I, like they were trendy in the seventies and eighties, I believe, and then they died hard. In but then my, they came back maybe like six or seven years ago. In my memory, at this time, roller blades would have been really cool to me, and roller skates <laughs> would have been something like lame my parents used. Me and me and Joe were rollerblading around in the gar in the garage. 
Yeah, we used to do short track rollerblade racing during the 2002 Olympics because we yep. got really into it. Yep. And uh, we would whip around our garage in the winter with uh, with just like some hockey sticks in the middle yeah. to be a circle. And we'd rip around it and we'd fall and tumble and, and it was crash cold. into it the walls. It was cold out there. Oh, yeah, because it was February. It was during the Winter Olympics. It was cold. Yeah. And we didn't give an F. We were just ripping. Well, you get ripping, you start heating up. Yeah, that's right. I also remember one time uh, we had an extension cord. And I was swirling it around like this, and you were trying to roller skate and jump over it. Genius, uh, genius Joe over here and Mike didn't realize that that extension cord was plugged in the whole time, and eventually you did catch it, and it sh- it shot sparks everywhere. I don't remember. You don't remember was, that? Yeah. That was uh, that was weird, man. You just doing stuff, huh? Just living life. I love remembering things where you're like, wow, that's really dumb. Joe, like, really dumb. Not I, even like a little bit dumb. All these memories just make me realize we were poorly supervised as children. <laughs> yeah, we got away with a lot of stuff. <laughs> all right. Well, that was great fun. Thanks, uh, Sierra, for bringing us down mem- memory lane with these. And, you know, people might have a problem here. with us getting into it, but like, that's what a lot of this music does, uh, especially because it just triggers so many memories. So many great memories. Yeah. Some bad ones. <laughs> All right, moving on. We never got caught for that uh, extension cord thing. Oh, nice. Yeah. It's probably I don't remember. I don't remember <laughs> things I got caught. 